Chaco. <laughs> How are you then? <laughs> Two more hours apiece. <laughs> then they'll all come storming back from their holidays. <laughs> bright eyed and ripe for mischief. <laughs> He's the rush. Professor Popper will wait. It's not seven o'clock yet. You don't understand. I'm helping him with a terribly important experiment. Ah! What a beautiful morning! Now what are you going to do? My feet are punctured. If it's that important, I'll telephone the press and tell him you're on your way. Bye. Napoleon was a general, they say he was a nasty fellow. But he loved his dear old mum, 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 mum. Napoleon was a general, he wrote his dance to dance. They say he was a nasty chap, but he loved his dear old mum. I'm terribly, I'm terribly sorry, sir. I had a punch, I just couldn't get here. Don't worry, Stephen boy. My name's Simon. Pardon? Simon. Tell Simon not to worry either. You're just in time, your sister telephoned me. Come along. All in here. I don't believe it's nearly ready, Samuel. Simon. Pardon? Simon. Simon, of course, Simon. Shouldn't be much longer now. Hello, my darlings. Don't be impertinent. Guard him with your life. Thank you very much. Now we take the D to the E to the L and pi R to the R. An angle of 45 degrees, is that right? Of course. I do wish you two would make friends. Ah! He is up. Ah, to start the morning with a nice cup of tea. A nice cup of tea and tea. Good gracious, that's interesting. along nicely. Start the morning with a nice cup of tea and then to work. Back to the great work. Napoleon was a general. He ruled de dum de dum. They say he was a nasty chap, but he loved his dear old mum. <laughs> now Solomon. Pardon? Simon. Simon, of course. Now, Simon, before we settle down to our tea, I have to tell you, I think I found the missing ingredient. The missing ingredient. The missing ingredient. Now, where the missing ingredient is missing? No, it's not a chair. Splendid. Now, Gracious, how very interesting, what? Just have a look at that and tell me what you think. <coughs> Napoleon was an emperor. He rolled it up and down. They say he was a nasty fellow, but he loved his dear old mum. There. Now, what do you think, boy? I don't think he quite follow it, sir. quite follow it. It's simple. A schoolboy could follow that. Uh, sir, I am a schoolboy. That's no excuse. Now, let's have another look. <coughs> yes, you see, if we multiply, we multiply the top factor by the ninth factor and bring it from the... No, 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 what I meant to write was, if we took an equation from the... The sugar! Uh, oh, conkers. The sugar, the sugar! Be quiet, Newton, you know you don't take sugar. <coughs> Newton doesn't take sugar, Stanley. Simon. Pardon? How very interesting. I was saying, Marcus, Newton's like yourself. Doesn't like sugar in his tea. Bad for the old toothy pecks. Come along, then. Phew. 
you know, perhaps it's not as simple as it seems. But I'm sure I had it right. Don't you think we should contact Professor Clubby? Certainly not. You and I have worked on this formula for years. I want to surprise him with my discovery. <laughs> no buts, boy. No buts. Here, a toast, dear friend. Here's to something very big. <laughs> Peculiar taste in tea. What happened, Pills? You didn't. Conkers! Great steaming conkers, what have I done? Can't have him late for assembly, can we? Be nice to for him to where we are. Can't have him late for a day of assembly. <laughs> There's a bummer. Right, now wedge the spoon. Under some files. Now heave, boy, heave. Yes, sir. Steady, heave. Have you got dresser? The band will attract their attention. Heave, steady. There's a bummer. That's funny. It's a tomb. How is she going? What disaster have you brought upon us now? Well, he's not him, sir. It's me, Crickle. Oh, 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 Crickle. Well, well, what's going on here? Where's the professor? Well, he's a mystery to me, sir. I came in to see if he's getting dressed when bang, if you see what I mean. But this is an outrage. Look at this place. <laughs> oh, I should never have agreed the professor could stay here during the holidays to pursue his absurd experiment. <laughs> To me, sir, it not be in the air and that we get. Well, stop dribbling, man, and let's go and find him. No good is only knows where he's going to have gone. Sir. How are you, boy? Well, I'm all right, but I feel small. Small? You are small. Two inches small. What happened, sir? It was a tea, boy. You recall the reducing tablets that I invented? We put them in our tea mistakenly for sugar lumps. And now we're shrunk. Two inches shrunk. It's a bit, a bit frightening, sir. Oh. Pardon? It's a bit frightening. A bit frightening? Nonsense. Rubbish. Remember, fear is only an excuse for being afraid. P, 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 P. A professor pop a point to ponder. Remember that always. I must make some notes. Answer the phone, boy. word and over the... Good gracious, you're terribly agile. Oh, come on, Papa. Do answer, there's a good chap. Just wait till you see this. The formula completed. A sure way to return everything to normal size, and I got there first. Oh, come on, Papa. Why don't you answer? I don't think we can quite manage it, sir. Of course we can manage it, Bob. One last try. Are you ready? Oh, 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 oh,
nowadays. Hello? Uh, you are there. Hello? Oh, well, I can't wait any longer. <laughs> Won't Papa be surprised? I knew I'd find the answer first. My secret. Well, they've got another thing coming. Looks like he's going up. Well, take a closer look. Go back to headquarters. Go on. <laughs> 